Hello there everybody, my name is Coach Chad Longston, Bob well, Bob well, Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News update. This is from Thought Park Resort and this is on some speculation that could link to initialising 2020. Now, I was watching a video, uh, this is where the source came from, and it's just some speculation that I wanted to talk about. So take this with a pinch of salt, it may not happen. Um, but I just wanted to sort of talk about it and discuss my thoughts on it. Uh, so, before we get started, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Comment down below your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss a YouTube video. And for now, guys, let's get into this video. So, the speculation surrounds the Walking Dead Living Nightmare. Now, this was first introduced in 2017 as part of the Year of the Walking Dead for Thought Park Fright Nights. They also introduced Living Nightmare Extremes a couple of years ago as well. You know, so this maze has been at the height of popularity. However, many people have said that the maze has declined over several years. Now, with The Walking Dead, it's a licensing. So you've got to renew the licensing every few years. No matter how long the contract is, um, you've got to renew the licensing. There is speculation that The Walking Dead Living Nightmare may not be returning for the 2020 season. Now, one of the definitions, and this links to the initialising 2020 teaser campaign uh, from the end of year, sort of 2019 video from Thought Park. Um, initialising, one of the definitions is like, uh, in other, uh, on the same lines as like a clearance, uh, it's like a clearance of data for future use. Basically, that's one of the definitions or on the lines of that. So, you know, I think it, there's a way it could be linked. But, you know, initialising may not be, you know, for future use, you know, it may not be 2020, but 2020 could be the start of a future project. Now, you know, Walking Dead Living Nightmare, like we said, the people have said that the popularity of the maze has gone downhill, uh, not massively, but slowly but surely. I can't really confirm that because obviously I haven't experienced the maze myself, so I don't know how good the maze is yet. Um... That's what I'm kind of hoping it stays. Uh, <laughs> but like I said with the Walking Dead license ship, you've got to renew it every few years. Uh, you know, is Thought Park going to renew the licensing for the for the Walking Dead Living Nightmare? Is Living Nightmare going to come back uh, for the 2020 season? Uh, now, it may, it may be listed on the map. It may be listed on the app uh, right now that it's coming back. Um, maybe the map's not built data yet or the app or anything like that. Um... Obviously, like we said, this is just speculation, so I would take this with a pinch of salt. I would take nothing from this uh, for now, uh, but it's just something to sort of keep in the back of your mind just heading into the 2020 season. The speculation that Living Nightmare may not return for the 2020 season, which could lead to the end of The Walking Dead, the ride license ship for the old X coaster at Thorpe Park. So, um... You know, there's a real, there's a chance here it may not come back. I mean, Walking Dead started brilliantly when it was at the height of its popularity. Um, and because Walking Dead's gone on for a few years now, I think maybe it's time to, you know, give that license ship up. Obviously, I hadn't, you know, been to Thought Park to sort of experience the Walking Dead stuff. Uh, so it is an IP that I would miss out on. Uh, however, and from what I've seen from reviews and like online like POVs of the ride and the maze, etc., I feel like there are moments in the maze and moments in the actual re-theme of X into Walking Dead the Ride that can surprise me as an enthusiast. However, I think from the looks of it and from what I've seen from reviews, I think that um, you know the Walking Dead the Ride isn't exactly the best sort of IP to go for or re-theme to go for for X. So. Um, what I would like to see is if Living Nightmare is going to go, that leaves a huge empty space to be filled. Of course, you've got to think, the two previous mazes that were in that site, around the back of the Walking Dead the Ride building in the, in the Living Nightmare space, before that it was Cabin in the Woods, and even before that it was The Passing. So, you know, you've got a bit of maze history, so I think... If Living Nightmare was to be removed, if the speculation was true and it is to be removed, I think they're going to uh, sort of bring in a new maze. I don't think it'll be anything else other than a new maze, unless they've got any future plans for the Walking Dead the Ride site. Uh, if that licensing ship goes as well, with, along with the Living Nightmare, if the whole Walking Dead stuff goes, 
then of course you've got a ride sitting there that could be rethemed to X or if they decide that X's time in the park has come to an end and the pyramid needs to be removed uh, then you've got a you've got a decent site there you've got a decent site uh, but it's just a case of what they're going to do with it so overall I'm excited to see what's going to happen with this so thank you very much for watching this theme park news update make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you don't miss a YouTube video keep it on the coast live and I'll see you guys in the next video very very soon take care have an awesome day friends <laughs>